Hi. Before we get into this review, I wanted to mention that while I plan to do an in-depth review of the new DJI Osmo 3 camera, I plan to wait for DJI to address the current set of issues that the camera has exhibited, including some sharpness issues. Once these things have been addressed, I'll post a comprehensive review and guide for the camera. Okay, on with the Pilot Institute review. While there are a lot of videos on YouTube that cover what you need to pass the FAA Part 107 test to fly your drone commercially, most of them don't get updated with the latest material and changes that the FAA implements. Many of them are older and, as such, miss critical elements of the training that the FAA adds to the requirements. Remote ID, night flying, drone categories are but a few of the recent changes. For example, Tony and Chelsea Northrup's channel has a video that's over four hours long and is pretty comprehensive in nature, but it's over five years old now and as such it's no longer relevant. For me, I decided to pay for a training course that offered lots of learning resources and was kept current with FAA's constantly changing rules. I went with Pilot Institute. They claim over 99% pass rate for their students to take the course. A competitor of theirs is RemotePilot101.com that offers a similar course for the same price. A major difference is that Pilots Institute offers a refund if you do not pass. That refund includes both the cost of the courseware and $175 that the FAA charges to take the Part 107 test. They also offer full pilot training for your private pilot's license. I went with them because of their obvious expertise in aviation instruction as well as the refund policy. Clearly, they have a lot of faith in their courseware. Instead of just memorizing everything, Pilots Institute makes an effort to teach you the content. This way you understand all of the concepts. You don't just memorize a rule set so you'll pass the test. I'm a pretty inquisitive guy, so I'm always interested in the whys and wherefores of a given topic, instead of here is what you need to memorize to pass the course. The course is taught by Greg Riverdew, and he does a really excellent job. He is both engaging and entertaining. I'll let Greg give you a little bit more detail on exactly what the course offers. Do you want to successfully pass your Part 107 written exam and learn something along the way? This is your Part 107 course made easy. This is the only class that you'll need in order to not only successfully pass the test, but also become knowledgeable in the aviation ecosystem. Several thousands of students have already used this class in order to successfully become remote pilots. There is no prior knowledge necessary. I go over all the required topics and also give you the links to all the study material that you'll need. There's 12 and a half hours of content in short and easy to follow videos, all from the comfort of your home. This course can be watched from mobile devices and also from a desktop. No more searching on YouTube for a video that may or may not be accurate or may teach you something that's outdated. Everything is in one place, taught by an aviation professional who stays up to date with the aviation industry. I will be using engaging tools and graphics so you can learn it all right here. Regulation, drone performance, airport operation, how to listen to radio communications, how to identify airspace, how to read charts, how to predict and read the weather, how to identify and mitigate risk, how to submit airspace approval, and finally, how to apply for your certificate. This course is also perfect if you need it for renewal purposes. This course contains over 200 videos, 250 practice questions divided into 20 quizzes and three practice exams. You have lifetime access and also quick support from me whenever you have a question. We are so confident in this course that we will send you $150 if you fail the exam. So if you're ready to start learning and move your aviation career forward, enroll now and I'll see you inside the class. 
For every section, there are quizzes to allow you to ensure you understand the subject matter for that portion of the course. They also offer an Android and iOS app with flashcards. Each section of the course includes a downloadable PDF file with all of the slides and areas for notes for that section. Greg is also super responsive to questions, and you can post them in a section after each video as a comment, or you can email Greg directly and he'll respond pretty quickly. They also maintain a Facebook group for the students that's super helpful, as well as a Facebook group for each state, so you can find other folks in your area with which to fly or ask about good areas to fly, etc. In addition to the 107 training, the course includes another course entitled Drone Maneuvers Mastery. This is designed to help you improve your drone flying skills. Really, the 107 course alone is well worth the price, but you add in the drone skill training and you really get an amazing value for the money. Overall, I highly recommend this course. It's very complete and it got me my Part 107 certification. They also have a ton of bonus videos that are included as well as a lot of other free resources on their website that you can use regardless of whether you're a student or not. The areas that I struggled with the most were regulations, class E airspace, and drone classification. Regulations are pretty dry and since there's no theories associated with them, many are just rote memorization. Class E airspace is still a bit of a head scratcher for me. It starts at X except when it starts at Y kind of things. Drone classification can be a bit of a challenge as well as that determines what types of drones need remote ID and when they can be flown over people, etc. I thought the weather section would be the toughest, but I actually really enjoyed that part quite a bit and found it was not too tough to understand. At the end of it all, I got a 93 on my test. Okay, that's it for this review. I'll be posting more drone content in the coming weeks and months now that I have my 107 certification. I'll offer tips on how to avoid getting harassed as you fly, as well as money-making videos for you and your drone. So subscribe and hit the bell so you know when those go live. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit like if you enjoyed this video, as that helps other folks find it. And until the next video, take care.